Hey everyone and welcome back to Lipstick Affair with me, Miss Mo. So today, <sighs> me and ombres. I'm going to try another ombre look. Um, don't necessarily know how this will go. Um, but my vision is to have a two-toned ombre look. I know one of my past videos that I recently posted, I tried to do that, but I really didn't do it. I did more like color blocking type of look. Um, and I mean, I still like how it came out, but that wasn't my intention. Uh, my intention was to try to do a two-toned ombre look. So today, I'm going to be trying that. Um, I wanted to explore, you know, explore my colors. So I wanted to do, what's that thing called when the colors are like opposite of each other on the color wheel? Um, not contemporary, complementary. Be thinking, I want to do, use complementary colors. So... The colors I'm going to be using today are blue and orange. So I am going to have my bottom lip blue and my top lip orange. And we're just going to try to do like a transition fade. So it's going to be darker on my, it's my right side. So it's going to be darker on my right side. And then just going to transition into light. Or I can do darker darker here and light here um maybe i might try to do that because i think that might be a little bit cooler but we shall see what i'm going to be doing and i'm not going to talk throughout this whole video i'm just going to show you all um i want to be starting off with what my base colors are going to be so again i said i'm going to have blue at the bottom orange at the top so i'm going to start off like that and then I'm just going to work, do some manipulation with the colors as I continue to, you know, transition on my lips. So I don't know if that makes sense, but we're going to get into it. Okay, so I'm back. I had to go to the bathroom and wipe my lips because the blue was already getting on the top part of my lip and blue is not supposed to be in there. Um, so I'm going to be using a Q-tip to just help keep my lips separated um, while I'm doing this look. So...
yeah so supposed to have the blue at the bottom orange at the top um for the most part this look is kind of simple i mean to do it is kind of simple but it's just also very messy in the beginning i was saying that i had trouble because when i would close my lips some of the blue would get on my top part of my lips and i didn't want that um look at my hand y'all like it's crazy um but i'm going to take some pictures so y'all can see i mean i do like how everything is like a transition and you can see that it's definitely lighter in the middle it starts to get darker as you go to the joke joker corners um i do like the complementary colors being together like even though blue and orange are like kind of bright colors um i think it still goes i think it's very pretty um and so the blending i definitely needed my joker corners to be darker so that's why i use a um um this eye pencil on my joker corners to get it as dark as possible um this is the this is the essence eye pencil and then um uh, for my orange I realized that the oranges that I have are not that dark. Um, and I noticed, I know that this, the Alamel is going to be like a bright orange. Um, and, but I didn't have anything that was darker than that. Um, so I do have this ColourPop Sunburst, but it's barely anything in here. So it wasn't that useful. So I decided to go with brown. Um, because I know that using the brown can, brown and orange are like, I don't know how they relate it, but they relate it. <laughs> and so, let me sit back from camera. So, um, I decided to use the brown to kind of like add a little bit more darkness to the orange. Um, and then I just went over the orange again, um, to the the main orange again to just kind of lighten up some areas and then at the bottom of my lips um like i said i used the wet and wild um multi stick and then i use the sub zero um sugar peel and i like the sub zero um it's a very dark blue so I just added that blue to make it a little bit more darker. Again, I use the eye pencil to darken my corner so that can be as dark as possible. So it could just kind of show more of like a dark than going into light. So dark going into light. Um, yeah, that's about it. Again, this is a messy look. Um, and it's not very practical, but if you want to be extra... Why not? Um, <laughs> I'm going to take some pictures. And then just to be extra, I think I might just add that. Because I really like this this diamond ball out highlighter. I just might add that to it because why not? So I'm going to do that. And yes. So, but thank you all. Fashion Lipstick Affair. Let me know if you tried to do this look. Um yeah because i would love to see it <laughs> but thank you all for watching lipstick affair i'll see you all next time i'll see you all next so y'all i decided to add the diamond ball out y'all did this not just elevate the look or am i tripping Maybe I'm tripping. I mean, it is like midnight. But damn. <laughs> this ball out. Oh my goodness. This is the only Fenty thing I got. And this thing was definitely worth the $50 I paid for it. Oh, come on. Come on with it. Oh, my goodness. 
I just really feel like this diamond ball out just elevated the whole look. And maybe I'm tripping, but because you can see the transition of the colors. Like going from light to dark. The center is lighter because the diamond ball out is making it shiny. Um, Y'all, let me put this thing away. Like I said, re-read, 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 know what she doing. Okay, so I am done, for real. I really like it. Um, I liked it before. I really like it now. Um, so, for real, for real, that is all for me. Thank you all for watching Lipstick Affair. And again, if you all try to recreate this look, um... Or do something similar to it, like what other complimentary colors. Please send me a picture of it. I would love to see it. You can always email me at mozoloveinc at gmail.com. And yeah. So thank you all for watching Lipstick Affair. I will see you all next time. Bye. Alright y'all, so this is my final thing. Okay, so because I was done taking my pictures and doing all that stuff, I decided to rub my lips together. And this happened. So you basically got like two looks in one. You can go somewhere, have your two-tone ombre, you know, combination going on. You tie to, I mean, not tie to that place, but you go somewhere else. You mix the colors together. You got a whole just, uh, you know, it's it's fun. It's a little bold, but it's not as, you know, as bold as a two-toned ombre type of look you had going on before. Now you got something a little bit, you know, a little subtle, like a little, you know, a little calm down. Um... Yes. Two looks in one. Y'all. Y'all, y'all just don't know. Y'all just don't know. Y'all just don't know. Y'all just don't know. Hey. Is this not a pretty color? You can see the orange outline. <laughs> you can probably wipe that away, you know. Oh. I almost like the whole thing was. That's okay. Fix it just like that. But look at this transition. You see that like that's a transition that I be that I be trying to achieve, but that is hard to do. And like and once you do it on the bottom and the top and you just rub your lips together, it just it just goes. It just goes, y'all. It just goes. Oh wow, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my. Yes, yes, so if y'all definitely try this look, please let me know. I really wanna see what other colors um, you all try. Um, and as always, you can email it to me at mozoloveinc at gmail.com. Man. Y'all, you know what? I'm done. I'm done for real. Good night. Good. See y'all later. Talk to y'all later. Mwah, 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 mwah. I'm done. I'm done. Like, how? What? Oh, the transition. The colors. It all looks so beautiful, man. Just so beautiful. Wow. Damn. I wish I could do this. Wow. I'm like, I'm just speechless. Because I didn't know when I rubbed my lips together that it would look like this. I didn't know it would look like an even cooler combination. Like, this is just crazy. Okay, 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 okay. I'm done for real. Thank you all for watching Lipstick Affair. Bye. <laughs>